everybody how are you doing what's up we are back and um we're gonna play some more music for you guys that's right um i am gonna do some that's shout outs i am getting so many letters that come on um, wow. i better do shout outs now so i can get the next batch out on the next <laughs> round on. okay so um let me see let's cofield brothers for sure all right um hello to you guys leblanc over there hector morales google or coco i don't know he wrote <laughs> oh, he on. said i go by coco or google i couldn't tell whether it was a U or an O, so Coco Cuco. Um, um, hello to you, Stevenson Unit, Jay Rich there, Marco Antonio, Lisa Gutierrez over there at San Carlos Unit in Arizona. All right. Um, DC, who used to be a Beto brother. Okay. And yeah. now he's moved out of there, but hello, DC. Let's see, Tim and Tucker and F Pod and Seg and Michael's unit. Awesome. Hello, wow. Michael's yeah. unit. Seg, Michael's we unit. love you yes. guys. And um, shout and out to Mike West yes. too. Yes, oh, Come he on. does so, so much. much. Awesome. Yes. for everything you do. Absolutely. So Trash Man, that's his All name. Right. Okay. Okay. At Wainwright Unit and Hollywood. Hello to you. It was so good to hear from you. We love you so much. Um, Choice More Unit, Steve Landrum, who goes by Irish, um, Roscoe and Weecho. I think I'm, I'm saying that right. I'm I hope. <laughs> um, Stephen Jandis at Hutchins, Alicia Carranza and Hobby Unit, Jesse Thomas, um, Ricky L, David S, Timothy Cody, Cooley and Key at Blackwater Correctional. Wow. wow. Okay. Hello Come to on. you guys. And um, Codell Foster, Derek Randall, Brian Houston, I think it's Houston, over there at Polonsky, Jesse Sorrells, Albert. Prado and Ramsey, uh, Jimmy Davis over in Alabama, Michael Etchison at Northeast Correctional in Connecticut. Wow. Um, what's up, Connecticut? Wait a minute. It's Missouri. I'm oh, sorry. What's up, Missouri? <laughs> <laughs> um, it's it, Mel Melitin Arispe. Omelito Narispe and Tours Unit. Praise. Hello. Hey, what's up, praise? Um, it was good to hear from you. Praise. It's been a while. Obi. Ob to it, I think. Bear Albert Marcias, and let's see, Michael Keith, um, in Palage over there. I guess they got their tablets. I was yeah, wondering awesome. about that. Yeah, so awesome. they do got their tablets. Christopher Gonzalez, the Preaching Machine, Gil Emmanuel <laughs> Aparicio, Intero <laughs> Unit, Dion Williams, and Blake Blake Camp. Campreth, all the way in Ohio. Hey. Whoa. Isn't that crazy? I'm going to have so, to get in line for the nicknames because I wonder why he got the preaching machine and I got Beaver Cleaver. Come that on. is messed up, man. <laughs> I, I started laughing when you said the trash man because I was reminded back in the day in Henderson when we were pastoring and we were so busy, we had halfway houses everywhere. Um, I had a gray Ford F-150 and we lived out in the country. And sometimes we would throw the trash in the back of the truck and I have to take it in town to dump it. Huh. And sometimes I would go literally weeks without even having <laughs> the know, time to man. dump it. Wow. I know. So one of our assistants who was our helper at the church started saying that I should cut a commercial for the law office where I call myself the trash man <laughs> and say, he'll take out your trash. Come on. Come on. That's, a, that's, a, that's good. That's really good. So, you know, the singing man was saying to me in a letter, he said, Eve, the cat is out of the bag because I thought you did those names by memory. I said, are, you, uh -oh. are you kidding me? Yeah. Like, wow. How could I get all these new guys? Guys and new girls' you names. You spent half your week memorizing the list uh, of names. Yes. Oh, and right. then if I forgot anybody, oh, ay, ay, oh ay, my yeah. como yeah. me duele, like Selena. Okay, <laughs> so um, I do want to read a couple letters. You know, I'm getting so many letters, so many great letters, and we appreciate it so much, you guys. So yes. here's one. It says, Real Vida. I'm not going to say his name, but it says, I, I have been in the prison system for 27 years in and out. I would like to thank you and all the ones who have dedicated to give this amazing blessing, Real Vida has motivated me to rededicate my life to God. Come on. So good. For many years, I was part of a prison gang. Real Vida has given me hope to release this sickness sickness of bondage. And wow. truly it is. Wow. Come on, it yeah. is bondage, you know. And you know, like MC was saying, um, if you know that, if you've got Securus, and I think everybody that's got Pando is on Securus, right. we have an audio podcast in the Christian yes. app that many don't know about. They're just finding us on Pando. So by the way, go to the audio right. and we have about 50, right, Chris? Uh, 50. 
Yeah. About eight, I think. Really? Yes, we yes. got 58 um, episodes there you can listen to. Yeah. And some of them are video. The, what you find on Pando, you'll find in Real Vida TV there. And right. then the others are audio. You don't want to miss yes. those. And look um, up, it's called Real Vida Podcast. Yes. And so um, there, there's those. We were on radio for two years for those that are just meeting us. And you didn't know that. We were on radio in Texas for two years. Right. And so we're converting those podcasts to... Um, to podcast, right? So, right. Um, so yes. somebody wrote me this today, and he says, "I'm trying to figure out. It seems like they're backwards, some of them, and they <laughs> yes, are. They are. That's they correct. are because we loaded the first one we did to podcast, which was Brian T, mm-hmm. and yeah. then the other ones we loaded, we had to start going backwards right. from that right. day. Yeah. So you're getting every new week, but the dates are on there, aren't they, Chris? Yeah, for the, for oh, the yeah. old ones, yes. Yeah. So the date will be on there, so that way you can, li- if you must. He said, "My OCD is killing me." <laughs> yeah, that's and I my want- fault, man. I, I super apologize. <laughs> I want to find out like, you know, what order they're in. And some of them are backward because we're doing weekly what we do weekly. And then what we can in between convert from radio to podcast, we do that. And right. they're going backward from Brian T. Right. And, and I really wanted to eventually get in there and get it all organized yes. out. But yes. man, that just takes so much time. And I'm afraid that if I do that, that I'll mess up people's playlist or whatever. And you know, right. right. So anyway, we're yes. doing it that way. Um, and I want you guys to, um, uh, to know that yes. those that are on Pando, that we have the audio, those that are on audio, that we have the Pando. Correct. And yeah. by the way, um, we are trending on Pando right That's now. Right. Wow. Isn't that crazy? That's this crazy. little nobody. Right. Um, guys, girls. Yes. yes. Thank you Amazing. so much. So awesome. yeah. And we want to trend on Pando. And I'll tell you, here's why. Because you have to type in Real Vida in the audio podcast if you don't know where there. You're not right. going to type in right. Real Vida because how would you know? Right. And so on Pando, you can see us. And I want your brothers and your sisters to see us. Right. Um, right. And so they're going to see us there if they've got Pando, if it's trending. Correct. So watch us in Pando um, if you can, so that you can keep it trending and people can know we're there. And finally, when everybody yeah. knows, then we won't have to be, but hopefully we'll be trending anyway. Right. Come well, on. today, the day that we're recording this is only our fourth day on Pando. It's crazy. And we're already today starting to get the beginning of a wave of mail of guys and women Absolutely. who found us on Pando that had us on their tablets the whole and time right. and never knew. Right. And that's why trending is so important. We don't get paid uh, because right. we don't get money Listen for being me. trending. I don't, I, let me give you, we're about 150,000 downloads in four days. Yes. Right. So, I mean, look how God is. And I know yes. in the other app, we have way more downloads, but we can't track those. The only ones that, the only app that does that is Pando. Right. So let me finish the letter. Okay. So he's that he's been released from the sickness of bondage of being in a gang. Listen, you don't have to belong to a gang because we're in the Jesus gang. That's right. Now, right? Right. And um, he has recruited us. And and this is a real brotherhood. This is a real sisterhood. Right. Like this, this is the real deal where you pray for one another and you see things happen, right. where you yes. really have each other's back. Really, yes. You know, so so it says here. For many years, the homies promised me brotherly love, power, and fame, getting nothing from it but sorrow and pain. Yeah. I have no excuse not to serve the Lord. And I know many of you are you're church kids. Right. I mean, you're, you're right. ch- you know, acting all hard and everything in prison when the truth is you've been nothing but a church kid all along. And, Come you know, right. whether, you know, especially black mama and Mexican mama was making with the chancla real quick. Oh, um, you know, you, you grew up on the church bench. You were getting your ear plug, you know, pinched in your leg and saying, sit up boy, right. Or girl, or whatever. Right. Um, and you know, God. And so. Listen, let's get back to God. So it says, you know, God, I I have no excuse not to serve the Lord for he has been good to me through this storm. I hope one day I can give back to Real Vida Ministries um, through my testimony of this prison system. There are good faithful servants in here. And yes, we know that yes. who have been forgotten by society, but we stay firm in God's word. I will continue to pray for this podcast. And yes, we do have Pando as well. May God be with you always, tu hermano. So wow. I am really, really appreciate that. And he's originally from Lubbock. Um, here's another letter. Real Life Ministries just found you on the podcast app within the Securest platform. I'm here at Coyote Ridge Correctional Center in Washington State and C-Unit wow. on B-Side. 
Amazing. It's refreshing to hear other inmates around the nation are listening and seeking God, and they are. Come Feels on. like a community, and we are. It is. Even it's a though we can't all see each other. Thank you for encouraging us in the Lord. I also enjoy the music videos at the beginning and the end of the podcast. And so, um, yes, we have Pando. If you haven't found us on Pando, and you do have Pando, um, do go look for us there as well. Um, yeah. God is doing so much. Yeah, and I just want to say too, we're going to insert uh, on the video podcast a picture of the mail that Eve got oh, today. My goodness. We want wow. you guys, <laughs> all of you, to understand how much mail we're getting. It's overwhelming. Uh, but I love what that letter said about yeah. a community because yes. we want y'all to know when we read your letters and we get them every day and we read them mm-hmm. every day. In fact, a lot, of, a lot of times we take a field trip to the post office around yes. lunchtime. That's right. Uh, the yeah. three of us and sometimes Sam. Yeah, Chris available. goes, don't go get mail without me. Yeah, right. I mean, he's... he's yeah. She reads it out. I want to hear it. She reads it without me. It's no yes. fair. Yeah, but honestly, we're so busy. If we don't get it when we get it together, we miss it. But yeah. I want you to know when we read your letters, we are creating family. We're Absolutely. creating right. connections to you guys. And even if we can't respond to every single letter, and we, we would if we could. Right. If we had time, we would write back. We still want to hear from you because we want to know what God is doing in your life, what is doing on your unit. Um, uh, and it's so cool because then we get to read these amazing letters, right. just a few of them, and everybody else gets to be part of that community. So I love that. We do want to go ahead and continue announcing. Uh, we we have plans on Wednesday, May 3rd. We've talked, been talking about this in the last couple of podcasts. Thursday, May 4th is the National Day of Prayer all over the United States. Uh, and what we wanted to do is set a goal for hundreds, thousands, I believe thousands, tens of thousands, thousands. Right. of prisoners yeah. all over the United States and their loved ones and their family. Right. And guys, Come if on. you're on board to pray with us on Wednesday, May 3rd, please tell your family and friends. If you have a church on the outside, right. yes. ask your church to pray yes. with us. Right. Tell your pastor to contact us. Look, us. look us up because we want to connect and build That's the right. body of Christ right. around this, um, really this uh, huge movement that God is building. That's right. We're going to fast for sure, from 6 a.m. to 6 p.m. on Wednesday, May 3rd. That's Central uh, Standard Time. Central Standard Time here in Texas. Uh, the world revolves around Texas, That's for correct. those of y'all who don't know. <laughs> um, and we're going to fast and pray. It's a day of prayer for prisoners. And this is not going to be the last one. Right. It's going to be the first one that we do together. And the things that we're praying for is revival, which means to restore life or consciousness, to Come give on. new strength or energy Amen. is the definition of revival. And it means to turn around right. and head the other direction. Right. And that's what we've got you know, to and have. It's like the scripture that God gave me before we started on radio um, to the prisoners targeting those units. Um, can these dry bones live. Right. That's right. Lord, yeah. only you know. Right. Come on. And he said, begin to prophesy to him. Yeah. Right? Begin to speak life to him. Begin to breathe life into them. And that yeah. is by the presence of the spirit of God. And that is absolutely what he's doing. Amen. And, and if you guys, if you're going to fast and pray with us, write us, let us know. Yes, please. We need to know who's going to be with us. As a matter of fact, man, you can get everybody to sign it here. I'm going to pray. I'm going to pray. And you just, everybody let us know. So that I'm getting we can, letters. Yeah. Right. I'm getting letters that are I saying, know of at least seven different states. Uh, so far, and probably my honey knows of even more who've already committed to pray. So please join us and let us know that you're going to be praying with us that day. Second Chronicles seven fourteen says, then if my people who are called by my name will humble themselves and pray and seek my face and turn from their wicked ways, I will hear from heaven and will forgive their sins and, and restore their, their land. land. Come on. And then I love the next verse because most people only quote verse 14. Verse 15 says, my eyes, that's God's eyes, will be open and my ears attentive to every prayer made in this place. And you know what prayers you've prayed and you maybe thought that God wasn't listening, but his eyes and ears are open. He is focused right now on the prisons. And it's amazing what God is doing uh, here in the U.S. So we're going to pray that day for revival. We're going to pray for reform and we're going to pray for deliverance of God's people from bondage. Amen. Now, do remember um, to tell your families, and we know that you are, because some are even contacting us on our awesome. our website, which is www.real-life-ministries.org. 
Okay. So some of, some of them are going there and contacting us and we're hearing from them. Um, they can also hear the podcast on Spotify, iHeart, um, almost Google any podcast, Amazon right. music, overcast, iHeart radio podcast addict and more, and more. Right. So just look for it. Um, real Vida podcast. And you already know it's got that yellow mic on the front, um, of it. And so they can listen. They can also view the videos now because right. they can actually download the Pando app, yes. um, which is cool. And they also can download Podbean. Right. And or, or you can go on uh, YouTube. Amazon um, okay. uh, podcast, the videos there on Amazon podcast, on okay. Google podcast. We're even uh, on YouTube now, aren't yes. we? We are on YouTube as well. So, uh, Real Vita Ministries on YouTube. Okay, so they can find us on the video as well. And um, I do want to uh, say a few more things. Let me see. The best is yet to come, folks. We come haven't on. got even come our on, best man. stuff up, so I'm <laughs> yeah. I'm really excited about That's that. Right. Um, you know, Jesus is coming soon. Yes. He's preparing you, you know. Um, there's work, and it, it starts with you. Yes. Right. Okay? That's the thing is, is, is the work starts with us first. And and then once we can get ourselves on the road and get up and get it together yeah. just a little bit, you can start ministering to other people. Right. And um, it's really cool because people are growing all, all together, all at once. Um, some things that I do want to say to you, you know, a lot of people are writing and saying, you know, can you disciple me, um, you know, by writing to me. The discipling goes on right here. Like I can do way more on um, all of us, you yes. know, ministering the word of God, giving steps, giving the word of God. I mean, in every way and yes. and, you know, in different ways, because we all have our own unique um, stories and experiences. Um and, you know, it, it takes maybe it, it literally takes hours yes. um, to write two letters <laughs> or what right. have you, you yeah. know, <laughs> and um, and we and we can't get to it. But the truth is we do way more and have way more content on here that we're able to do with people. So discipling will be right here. Um, it's not that I, that I don't write anyone and I'm, I'm the, the one that has the most time and, and, and I don't have much, um, I don't do very much cooking anymore. Right. Um, and I'm putting on the pounds cause, uh, <laughs> because I'm eating all this You're bad crazy. food, but, yeah. um, anyways, you know, so, um, you know, just catch the episodes and you'll keep up with what's going on with us and, and all that together. Well, like you said, we can write a letter to two people in two hours or record a video yeah. podcast to, to 200,000 or 1.3 yeah. million. Absolutely. Yeah. And so, um, anyway, we love you guys so much and you're never forgotten. I mean, you're, you're never forgotten. And my husband's always shocked at how many names I've got in my head. <laughs> and, um, I not only got their name, but where they're at and what and their, their nickname. nickname. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and, um, and so there he, yeah. he's like, you know, who, Who's such and such? And I'm like, well, well, that's Shrek, you know? <laughs> um, and so anyway, I got and so their many, life story too. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> well, you know, and if people yeah. write me more than once, even if I can't write back and I'll tell you what, I appreciate those people so much that, that know the yeah. busyness and they're like, I know that you're so busy and you know, you don't have to write back. And it, it's really, um, something, you know, cause there's a lot of seggers, um, a, a lot that are on death row or that kind of thing. And they're like, Hey, don't worry about it. You know, I mean, I got a, a we've got a check from one guy on death row, the fifth check amazing today, wow. um, just trying to sew in so that he can let other people hear how, how amazing is that? Wow. Like, yeah. you know, I mean, how amazing is that? So anyway, I do want to share this scripture and it's mine. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. So Isaiah 61, the spirit of the Lord is upon me for the Lord has anointed me to bring the good news to the poor. And if you hear, heard the audio podcast, you know how much I love that word poor. Because when you look at the synonyms, the, the meanings of it, it means the indigent. It means right. the brokenhearted. Yes. It means it means those that have been neglected, those that are exhausted, um, those that have been abandoned. Um, he has anointed me to preach the gospel, the good news to the poor. And he has sent me to comfort the brokenhearted and to proclaim that captives will be released yeah. and that prisoners will be freed. Come on. Come on. And I'm proclaiming that and I've yeah. been proclaiming that since we started. And and it means, it, it don't just mean um, freedom to the world, but freedom 
Come on, freedom yeah, right. yeah. from self, freedom from hurt and pain, freedom yeah. from um, anger, freedom from addiction, freedom from, you know, all those things that happened that caused us to do wrong, freedom. Yes. And so it says that he has sent me to tell those that mourn that the time of the Lord's favor has come. Come on. The time of the Lord's compassion is what it means. The the time of the Lord's like kindness and generosity mm, right. and yeah. his protection come has come. And I mean, he had yeah. me proclaim that and we're seeing it. Come on. And with it, the day of God's anger against their enemies. Come wow. on, come on, come on. Wow. Uh, to all who mourn in Israel, those who are God's people are Israel. He will give a crown of beauty for ashes, a joyous blessing instead of mourning, festive praise mm. instead of despair. And in their righteousness, they will be like great oaks. Yeah, come mm, on. That the Lord has planted for his own glory. Yeah. And I'm telling you that what we are seeing is people activated, activated wow. um, in those prisons that going, okay, like that's all it takes. So, so, somebody that says you can do this. They're like, okay, yeah, I can right. do this. <laughs> right. Yeah. Come on. You know, and I know like the Lord says we can do it. But it is so much more to see the people of God be the extension of his yes, hands and feet right. and the body yes. of Christ, that he's the head and we are Come that on. body and we are that one body so that when someone, mm. one person around you loves you and says, you can do this and you are worthy and you are washed and, and, and you get activated. Yeah. So all over the United States, we're getting letters and people are saying, look, I thought I wasn't worthy, but I heard the podcast and I heard what God was saying that yeah. I am worthy. So I begun a Bible study. And, and, and so now I'm teaching 20 guys. Now I got Come moved on. to a new unit and yeah, I've used right. it to preach the gospel and I've used it to spread the word about Real Vida <laughs> podcast. It's crazy how yeah, God is not... doing these great things. And so anyways, I'm really excited about what God is doing and um, to be a part of it. Yeah. Like it is such an honor for us, such an honor um, to be a part of this great move of God in the prison system. Yes. Amen. And I wouldn't trade it for the whole world. Yeah. Like there's nothing, nothing, nothing. There's no trouble. There's no great thing. There's no amount of money. There is nothing, nothing, nothing that could take me away and make me do something different. What an amazing God. I mean, Amen. look at this. I'm even on podcast. On. <laughs> <laughs> I never dreamt that yeah, I would do on. this and um, yeah. nobody else did either, but look yeah. at God. So we are yeah. so, so grateful. I don't know if there's anything else you want to say. If not, we're going to share some more music with you. Um, Really great music. And, um, you know, for podcasts, we have to get permissions. Right. And so um, I will do Espanol as soon as I can, I promise you. We are trying to contact some Hispanic yeah. singers um, to get permission to pre play their videos or music um, by video and podcast. And so um, an audio podcast, I mean. And so we will do that as soon as we can pray that yes. they respond quickly right. um, so that we can do that. They got to impress um, upon them right. to, to yes. respond. And I know we will. Yes. So we will yeah. do as much as we can out here. And um, in the meantime, you guys pray. We're all in this together. Yeah. Right. And so um, we're excited to be that way. And here's your music. God bless you.
There's a little more to it than church on a Sunday Nobody's buying their ticket to heaven when they pass the plate We can sing that song and do that dance But we're just sharp-dressed hypocrites We leave it behind the double doors underneath the steeple Who's that man on Monday? Does he walk and talk the same way? Is it real or religion? Two lives we're living to say that we're okay. God ain't looking for a sold out show, no, He's looking for a sold out soul. But we'll keep getting cheated halfway, believing until we let Him change. A man on Monday might not stand behind a pulpit, but our lives are preaching. Oh, and everybody's watching to see if we really believe it Give that devil an inch and I'll take him out I'll Make a fool out of us one day at a time Don't hide the light, keep it shining Let's live like we made it Who's that man on Monday? Does he walk and talk the same way? Is it real or religion? Two lives we're living to say that we're okay God ain't looking for a sold out show, no, he's looking for a sold out soul. But we'll keep getting cheated halfway, believing until we let him change. A man on Monday. Who's that man on Monday? Does he walk and talk the same way? Is it real or religion? Two lives we're living to say that we're okay. 
God ain't looking for a sold out show No, he's looking for a sold out soul But we'll keep getting cheated Halfway believing Still we we'll let him change A man on Monday Correction. The only thing that's required is a lens that's genuinely objective And a minute of your time to wrap your mind around divine perception Cause even the most mindless and spiritually blind Can be the spectator in a theater of God's magnificent design If you would incline your ears and your eyes to these sounds and these signs We would attempt to rightly refine and align your crooked sight But we not inclined That a sunset or an ocean can begin to set in mind When the son of man began to set in redemptive motion For morals, meaning, and devotion Heart, mind, and emotion Substance, significance, and truth cannot be Explained or reduced to a big bang explosion Because his character and nature cannot be known through natural revelation Or shown through random acts or figments of your imagination We the beautiful eulogy attempt to communicate audibly and visually To help you hear and see the glory of God clearly So your love everlasting I start where I finish Pick it back up where I left it I'm just a man of unclean lips I've only seen a glimpse But everywhere I look I see his fingerprints All things were made through him We received his revelation So we reflect it when we breathe And the concepts we conceive Are born of spiritual seed Manifest in the material realm As musical composition The rhythm of heartbeats Transformed by the gospel And godly wisdom I'm an instrument of his mercy Unworthy but still he uses me The beauty of the eulogy Through his death we are truly free Free indeed The condemnation and the bondage Of our sin was abolished on the cross And he alone accomplished it God made himself known Exposing his own nature And his glory through his son The revelation of our savior The fullness of God Born in human form Deity in the flesh We need a spirit and the word To open our eyes So we can see correct The vital lens Then let it be for my king, Jesus 
death, burial, sweet resurrection Every day perfecting this holiness for such a perfection uh, God is my witness, I choose love and forgiveness Fight the good fight of faith until I'm faithfully finished Hey, Take the publishing, keep the royalty I won't compromise you, Lord, you have my loyalty See, I remember I was beating on my chest I was rapping for this world, I was rapping about death Now I'm out here in the street, in the spirit, not the flesh Got the neighborhood game, bangers asking me, man, what's next? Somebody died last night gambling for some cash and dice If there's an afterlife, I wonder man what's after life That's when I look him in his eye like, please just listen to me It's no coincidence right now that God just sent you to me And let me tell you about the truth that set you free Salvation found in Jesus, I promise it's what you need, yo They don't want me on your radio They don't want me on your screen Cause they know that I won't compromise And I'ma praise the risen king why your feelings get hurt? The truth set you free, set you free from the curse To church for the street, to street for the church Last one on earth, but in heaven I'm first They don't want me on your radio Long as I'm preaching this gospel, they not gonna play me, bro They hated Christ, so they gonna hate me, yo But I don't gotta take it, so Personal, it's not the personal, that's just how Satan go But you can have the glory in life, whether morning or night I'ma tell the story of Christ I'd rather be rich in spirit than be rich in flesh Content like Abraham, but Lot wanted a lot So Sodom's where he pitched his tent Sacrificing God for the paper When it'll be gone in a vapor I gotta be honest, your labor is in vain If it ain't Christ, told me you playing with your life You finna meet Jesus, knowing you never acknowledge is your maker Radio ain't playing this Notice what they push to you Smoke, drink, and high slide Everything Jesus wouldn't do Joshua stood up and said Homie, God has been good to you So put away your idols He deserves it Grab your Bible Call him by his proper title Why you scared of the church? You can have this world for now But soon we will inherit the earth I'm not against you though I don't want you to perish or hurt I pray you come to Christ So that you can be spared from the curse Please this ain't no Papa Top 40, we giving the Father God glory I'm giving them props for every drop of blood he conquered death for me Taking the gospel where it's hostile, they gon' have to destroy me Before I compromise, I backslide, and that's why They don't want me on your radio They don't want me on your screen Cause they know that I won't compromise And I'ma praise the risen king Why your feelings get hurt? Truth set you free, set you free from the curse To church for the street, to street for the church Last one on earth, but in heaven I'm first Didn't know where it was leading to 
It was clear as day, but somehow I couldn't see the truth. I was a heathen who was deceived since a freaking youth. A young streak recruit out here trying to seek the juice. So I proceeded to leave the stoop and I had some things approved. I spent all my bread when I bought the lie, so I needed loot. Man, some cats could have noodled me. Then afterwards, drink the soup. I slipped through the cracks, but it wasn't my own doing. Only by the grace of one who sits on his throne ruling. I was so foolish, but the Lord brought me close to him. I was broken, but Yeshua is the reason to change on my soul. Loose and I was sealed. Blind for real, I was running. My eyes was peeled, and Christ was revealed to this young. And my stripes was healed, it's signed and sealed. Now I'm under his influence and behind his will, like I'm drunken. I need you now more than I ever needed you, Lord. More than what I ever needed before. before. I'm crying out, I need you more. I need you, I need you. The wings of my gun left me drifting here without an oar. Stranded and I have lost sight of the shore. Hey guys, I'm going to share this scripture from Joshua chapter 1, verse 7. It says, Be strong and very courageous. Be careful to obey all the instructions Moses gave you. Do not deviate from them, turning either to the right or to the left. Then you will be successful in everything you do. Please don't forget about the day of prayer for prisoners, Wednesday, May 3rd, fasting and prayer from 6 a.m. in the morning till 6 p.m. Central Standard Time. Please write us and let us know. It's Real Life Ministries, Post Office Box. 131722 Tyler, Texas 75713. Thanks.